Here I am, just arrived in my hotel. It's the Figueroa Hotel. It's got this whole very interesting look to the entire front entrance of the hotel. And the inside's even more exotic. And that's the salon, or I believe the restaurant. Time to go in. Here's the entrance from the inside. Very interesting artwork, style, the entire place. It's just extremely exotic. The walls, ceiling, the lighting. Really quite an interesting looking place. Chairs, the restaurant. There I am entering the room. That's what my room looks like. And it's all sort of antique style looking furniture. I like that decor on the wall, very cool. An old type of, I guess it's like a Moroccan footstool. Even the curtains are really kind of cool. The curtain rods. And nice tapestry on the wall. I'll we'll admit that the bathroom is a tad small, but fairly functional. It's my room, 318, this is the hall that I'm in. But there are some of these doors that have these way exotic patterns. I'm not sure if that is the the really fancy suites that they have. Maybe it is, because I've seen it like that. I see a lot of complaint doors, and then you'll see this fancy door. And there's kind of an odd looking lamp for you. It's an interesting lamp on the table. Again, the cool kind of curtains. Interesting chair. And these are the elevators. This is a stairway going down between floors. Again, see, just so exotic, all the color patterns that are here. And everything has sort of an old worn look, just as though they were in Morocco. The hotel in this area that's called that's considered a mezzanine. Interesting lamp on the ceiling, and even nice music going on. And it's even an upper bar here, but it's been closed. It wasn't even open last night, so I'm not sure when they opened this. And last night was a Saturday night. Here's the sign for the swim pool and the brand of bar. Interesting, it's a kind of tile painting on the wall of California. Pretty slick, the whole place. And they've got some interesting music going on too. I love these doorways, very cool. And look at this thing. Very big ornate doorway. It's another big sitting room for like uh, parties and gatherings. And here's the hallway that runs down to the pool. Further down the uh, hallway here that goes to this back patio and the swimming pool area. 
I'm not sure what this is, but it looks like it's some sort of a plant on the wall. Even this whole doorway, it really went nuts on this whole place. I love it. Look at that doorway. <laughs> Hard to believe. And here's the bar by the pool, which is not open now, but the pool is. This is the back pool area. So here's the back pool area. And they've got it all decked out with this whole greenery. It makes it feel like it's in a jungle or something. So this is beyond the hotel. This hotel's been here ages. Supposedly in the 1920s, it was a uh, YMCA. So there's the back of the hotel. It's been painted over, but I can imagine if it was regular brick, it would be typical looking of a uh, YWCA or YMCA hotel. Nice sculpture, and there's my favorite part, the hot tub. So again, these are all new constructions here. This is the LA Live building, and there's two new hotels, huge, and one of them is the Seagraph Main Hotel. What I hadn't noticed before, here in the bar by the pool, there's this odd sort of, almost like a bed. But I know Morocco might be a place where it's just like a lounge and people can all sit on it like it's a big sofa. But boy, that is cool. And look at the old style fan lamps on the ceiling. These are really interesting sculptures in this dining area, bar dining area or by the uh, elevators. And of course, we have the inside of the elevator. I just noticed that now it's the infinity effect.